as parameters for a two port network with mismatched loop a two port network or junction is formed when there is a discontinuity between the input and output ports of a transmission line the terminal reference planes 1 and 2 are chosen beyond the distance of the order of one wavelength so that the equivalent voltage and currents at these positions are proportional to the total transverse electric and magnetic fields respectively for the propagating mode only these circuits are analyzed using s matrix formulation consider a two port network terminated by normalized load and generator impedance is equal to 1 then the reflection coefficient at load end is given by z del by z not minus 1 divided by z del by z not plus 1 then reflection coefficient at port 1 is s11 plus s12 s21 and reflection coefficient at 2 divided by 1 minus s22 reflection coefficient of 2 therefore for a mismatched load input reflection coefficient reflection input reflection coefficient is not equal to s11 for a reciprocal network s12 equal to s21 so that reflection coefficient at port 1 is s11 plus S12 square reflection coefficient at port two divided by one minus S22 multiplied with reflection coefficient at port two. further if the junction is lossless s11 and conjugate of the s11 plus s12 conjugate of the s12 parameter is equal to 1 S22 conjugate of the parameter plus S12 conjugate of S12 parameter is equal to one. S11. S12 conjugate plus S12 S22 conjugate is equal to Z. Therefore, for a lossless reciprocal two-port network. terminated by a mismatched load magnitude s11 is equal to magnitude of the s22 and magnitude of the s12 
is equal to square root of 1 minus magnitude of S11 square and the input reflection coefficient is S11 plus S12 square reflection coefficient at put 2 divided by 1 minus S22 and reflection coefficient at put 2. This equation is the working equation for the computation of the S parameters. The following properties are common for S, Z and Y matrices. Number of elements are equal. For reciprocal devices, both S matrix and Z matrix satisfy reciprocity properties. If Z matrix is symmetrical, S matrix is also symmetrical. The following are the advantages of S matrix over Z and Y matrices. Equipment is not readily available to measure total voltage and total current at the port of the network. Short circuit and open circuit are difficult to achieve over a wide range of frequencies. Presence of active devices such as power transistors and tunnel diodes makes the circuit unusable for short and open circuit. The unitary property of in S matrix helps a quick check of the power balance of lossless structures. No such immediate check is possible with Z and Y matrices. S matrix is defined for a given set of reference planes only. If the reference planes are changed, the S coefficients vary only in phase. This is not case in Z and Y matrices. Because voltage and current are functions of complex impedance and therefore both magnitude and phase change in Z and Y matrices. Take down on problem. Two transmission lines of characteristic impedance Z1 and Z2 are joined at plane PP dash. Express as parameters in terms of impedances. Solution. We know that for a matrix output is equal to S parameters into input. Assuming that output line to be 0 that is A2 equal to 0. Then the input impedance Zin is equal to Z2 which is also equal to load of line Z1. Therefore, S11 reflection coefficient at port 1 is equal to Z2 minus Z1 divided by Z2 plus Z1. Similarly, for symmetry, assuming input side is matched, that is A1 equal to 0. Therefore, Z1 minus Z2 divided by Z1 plus Z2 which is equal to S22 which is nothing but minus S11. In general, B1 equal to S11 A1 plus S12 A2. B2 equal to S21 A1 plus S22 
A2. With output line masked, that is A2 equal to 0, a pure shunt element B2 is A1 plus B1. So what is B1? That is A1, B1 is, B1 is S11 A1. Since A2 equal to 0. This we will get when I apply to the A2 equal to 0 for equation 1. Therefore, B2 equal to A1 1 plus S11. B2 by a1 equal to 1 plus S11. B2 by A1 is S21. That's equal to 1 plus, what is S11? S11 is a 2 minus Z1 divided by Z2 plus Z1. S21 is equal to 2 Z2 divided by Z2 plus Z1. With input line matched, that is A1 equal to 0, then B1 equal to A2 plus B2. So B1 equal to A2 plus what is B2? B2 is equal to S22 into A2. When A1 equal to 0, that is we apply to the equation 2, we will get B2. B2 is equal to S22 into A2. Therefore, B1 equal to A2 1 plus S22. B1 divided by A2 is equal to 1 plus S22. B1 by A2 is S12, which is equal to 1 plus S22 is equal to Z1 minus Z2 divided by Z1 plus Z2. Therefore, S12 yes, is equal to 2Z1 divided by Z1 plus Z2. Therefore, S yes, matrix for given problem is S11 yes, is equal to Z2 minus Z1 divided by Z2 plus Z1. S12 is 2Z1 divided by Z1 plus Z2. S21 is equal to 2Z2 divided by Z1 plus Z2. S22 is Z1 minus Z2 divided by Z1 plus Z2.